I'm in Shifty D's room right now, he's not here. And I realized, you know, three years ago, Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy came out and I made the whole video. We moved and so we had to move everything, all our stuff, all the games, everything, put it into storage and stuff. And then some of that stuff from storage we brought to the garage and we had rats and they destroyed a lot of stuff like the original grass skirt in the Crash 1 review where Pap was, you know, Papu Papu. But, you know, I could just get another one, it's fine. And so I'm looking through the boxes where I have my original games. I'm like, oh, no noise everything's all fine everything's good and in the same box on the corner we have the uh there's like these holes that you use you know to lift the box and move it for most of the boxes you know when we moved i put like these cardboard things like these little pieces of cardboard so that way you know no bugs or anything can come in there i had it like all taped and everything but i just looked right now i was looking through the stuff and i'm like oh i see a blue cover PlayStation 4 cover and I remember I pre-ordered it and I went to Gameflop. I made that video I went with the mask and everything and look at this I opened it and it's completely destroyed and the thing is that this is the only thing that's destroyed too like everything else seems to be fine like it doesn't seem like the rats got to it and I guess in the hole right they must have like bit through or something because you see that it's completely cracked look at that like it's destroyed the top is like completely gone Cortex is gone, you know, has been destroyed there. You can't even see him anymore. And the worst part, right? Like, you see where they bit? Like, they bit through right there. I opened it because I'm like, okay, hopefully at least the game works. Look at that. You see that? Like, even... Like, what the turd, man? Like, these rats are bootleg. And I opened this, but there's a battle scar there, right? And I'm like, okay, maybe they just scratched it, right? But you feel with your finger and you can see it's kind of going out. And I'm like, oh no, that's not good. Right there in the corner, you see that? It's like completely bit through right there. I don't think that's playable anymore. So yeah, that sucks. Like this is the copy I played on stream. Like I know it's on a computer now, but I don't have a computer that can play it. I have a Switch, I can play that version, but like, you know, I bought this. Look at that, here's the bottom of the case. I'm just kind of disappointed. Here's the back, I don't know if I showed it. I'm disappointed, like what the third rats? And, you know, like I said, it's a game, but it's kind of important to me. You know, like I like I said, I bought this, like I saved cash and I, I bought um, Crash Bandicoot, I was excited. And yeah, that's all I wanted to say. Come on now. Yeah, this isn't just a random Call of Booty or some football game or some junk. Like if it was that, I wouldn't, you know, care. And it would have been even worse, like a year after this game came out, I think Spyro was announced. And I believe there's like a Spyro and Crash combo thing, like a bundle. It would have been even worse if I didn't get this version, but I got that one. And they destroyed, you know, both Crash and Spyro. I'm gonna bounce out of here though. That's all, I just wanted to share that. Bootleg, pure bootleg.